Very warm, muggy conditions expected to continue for the next several days in Ohio. That's not good news, especially if you suffer from this heat and humidity. Boy, it was oppressive yesterday. Humidity, temperature was like 85, 86 degrees in the Kermerstown. Humidity was 65% or so. And that's not, that's not good. Anyway, national map. You can see a stationary front, south central Ohio. High pressure to our north. That's trying to push the front to the south. High pressure to the south, trying to push it to the north. You have a battle zone that's trying to set up there. Get my point. It's in Ohio and uh, we could have some showers and storms developing along that front at any point in time during the day with the heating of the day as that conflict zone takes up residency in the state of Ohio. Close up look at the map shows temperatures ranging from the low 70s in southwest Ohio in the Dayton area to 55 cool, pleasant, crisp degrees up here in Ashtabula, the northeast corner of the state. And now let's take a look at your traveler's forecast on the day Wednesday. Heat building back up. You can see highs in the low 90s along the Ohio River and upper 80s elsewhere. Partly sunny to mostly sunny skies expected across the state. And a shower and thunderstorm could pop up at any time, at any location, so don't be surprised. Will that be the case for the next several days? Well, let's take a look at your National Weather Service five-day forecast and find out. There you have it. Well, on the day Wednesday, we're expecting sunny skies, but very warm conditions. And then Thursday through the remainder of the work week and into the weekend, there is that chance of shower and thunderstorm activity as the heat and humidity continues to linger. And the frontal system continues to pick up residency in Ohio. So until the next time, stay cool and have a good day.